In this video, we are going to log document use by tracking PDF opens or views. First, open Windows Explorer. Locate the document you wish to protect. Right click on the PDF and choose Make Secure PDF. In the Writer window, select the Expiry and Validity tab. In the Verify Document Access area, select the Each Time the Document is Opened option. Then, in the Printing and Viewing area, in, in the Viewing section, select Log Document Views. Then click Publish. The Protection Status window appears and confirms that the Protection Status has succeeded. Click OK. The newly protected document now appears in the folder underneath the original PDF. Please notice it has a .pdc extension. This is now a protected PDF file, which can only be opened with the Lock Lizard PDF viewer. If we double click on the file, the Safeguard Secure viewer will open and load the document. OK, this is the first time we've opened the document. To get a count, we will close it and we'll open the document a second time. Double click on it again. Again, the Safeguard Secure Viewer will open and load it a second time. OK, now we've finished with that. We'll close the viewer and we'll close Windows Explorer. To check how many times the document has been viewed, we need to log into the Safeguard Admin System. So click on the Windows icon, scroll down to L, click on Lock Wizard, and click on Administration System. In the login area, enter your login details and click Login. In the Admin System, click the Documents tab. Here you can scroll down and select the document in question from the list, if you wish, by selecting the box in the top left corner. Or if there's a lot of documents and you can't easily see the name, you can search for it using the filter field. If you start typing in the name of the document, it will appear in the listing below. You can click on it. It will then be singled out below. Once you've got the document in question, click on the Details tab. Then, in the Manage Access area, click on the View Document Open History button. The History window opens and shows you the document details, and it shows you when it was last opened, the date and time, the user who opened it, and the user ID. You have the option of select and see how many users have opened it, by bulk or by selected users. Easiest way of doing that is to click on the Selected Customers button. It takes you to the Customers area. Here you can click on Individual Customers, or if you have a lot of them, you can click on the Check button. That will highlight all customer records, and then say OK. The Customers IDs are entered into the Customer ID field. You then have the option of setting up a date range. So if you want to see how many times that document was opened in the last month, for instance, you can ask it for that period of time. Just click on the calendar option and choose the dates from the calendar for the between and dates. Once you're happy with that, click OK. The search is then run and the results appear underneath the window. So here we can see that Alan Jones opened the document twice and you can see the date and time. The other user's ID is shown there, but there's no open history logs for that user. If you wish to save that information, you have the option of exporting it to an Excel CSV file. There we go. Exports it to a file, and you can see the basic details saved there. OK, so we close Excel. Once we're finished, close the window, log out to the admin system, and close the browser.